Hey YouTube, this is a tutorial on how to play Virtual Boy on the computer. For this tutorial, you're going to need two things. An emulator, which is Red Dragon, and a ROM file. For this tutorial, we'll be using Wario Land. The links are in the description below, so you can follow along, and you'll be playing Virtual Boy in no time. First thing you're going to want to do is create a folder on the desktop. Call it Virtual Boy. I mean, you can create it anywhere. But to follow along, just do it on the desktop. Call it Virtual Boy. Next thing you're going to want to do is go to the first link for the emulator, which is Red Dragon. It will take you to this website, the Emulator Zone. While you're here, if you scroll all the way down, you'll see Red Dragon 0.38. Click that, and uh, it'll download it. It's a zip file, so I mean, you're going to need a zip extractor such as WinZip, WinRAR. I use AlZip. Click OK and it will open it up. Now that you have it, you want to extract all the files here just by clicking extract into the newly created folder. Now that we have that, it's time to get the ROM. If you get onto the second link, it will take you to Dope ROMs in order to get Wario Land. So if you scroll down, you'll see download ROM. Click that. It'll take you to this page where you scroll down again and here's the download link. You're going to follow the same procedure as last time. Extracting it into the same folder. Okay, now that everything's ready, you can X out of everything. Free up some RAM. Now go to that folder, and you'll see Red Dragon right here. It looks like a uh, Virtual Boy controller. Double click it. And it will bring up the emulator itself. Now, before you start anything, I want you to go to Options and Input. And here are all the controls, which are uh, on the keyboard. As you can see, is like... The basic analog is E, C, S, F, and M and N or A and B. I mean, that's all you really need to know for this game, but it, it is a mess, and it, it's hard to play. I mean, you can set these up any way you want. So if you go to File, Load ROM, you'll see Virtual Boy Wario Land. Click that. Click OK. And it loads up. Now, the thing I like about this is it automatically puts everything in gray. I mean... You can switch it to red if you want, but the Virtual Boy is infamous for giving people headaches. I think it's kind of funny too, because this wasn't on the market long due to that. But if you look right here, it says automatic pause. I mean, you can shut it off. It's only really created to give your eyes a rest while playing this, if you're looking into the actual Virtual Boy itself. I mean, uh... I tried to install a controller just to see if I could get it to work with this. The only way to do it is actually to have a program that will input your controller as if they are keys on a keyboard. So like when you hit a button it's like almost as if you're hitting A on the keyboard. That's the only way to get a controller working with this. I was using XPatter but it's no longer free. So uh... You're going to have to use the keyboard or try and figure that out. But that's how you play Virtual Boy in the computer. Uh, good luck playing it. I'm not sure if you'd really want to, though. I mean, this thing is not that popular. <laughs> Goodbye, YouTube.